Are you kidding me? What the heck? <sighs> Good morning, guys, and welcome back to another video. It's Katie. I hope you're having a fantabulous week. It is currently 10.08 in the morning, and we are going to be doing a school, work day, day in my life, what it looks like to live like Katie. <laughs> Every single morning I wake up in between 9 and 10 a.m. It really just depends. You guys know I take all of my classes but one virtually in college. So I only have to go into my high school for an hour and my first class starts at 11. The luxury that I love to live. So I get to wake up later, which is super nice because of that. I sleep in like a lot. I'm not a morning person and I also stay up really late doing schoolwork assignments that kind of stuff so it's kind of like a balance it's a give and a take and I am so blessed to be able to wake up like this late for school because I know people have to wake up at like 5 a.m. I literally don't think I could do that you guys saw how that went for me when I took the ACT but I love vlogging it's like literally my calling and I thought we would do a vlog they're so fun and hopefully this is gonna be like a long video you can sit down and watch while you're doing your makeup or taking a shower or I don't know I love long videos long vlogs are the best you guys saw I just woke up every morning the first thing that I do is get ready just because it starts my day it wakes me up it's also my personal time to myself which is something that I think is so very important you'll realize throughout the day that I am extremely busy very hard for me to find time throughout the day to spend to myself and I think getting ready and doing things that are important to you for you is so important if I have 10 minutes in the morning to be myself and be by myself and just kind of put some makeup on then I think that's awesome I'm just putting a little concealer on this is benefit boing i've been struggling with some pimples recently and you guys know that i have never really struggled with acne and i wouldn't even call it acne i know that i'm blessed to have very nice skin i have had like a few pimples right here again i think it's simply due to the fact that i have to wear a mask in school and when we cheer and practice and stuff i think wearing a mask all over again is kind of breaking my chin out it's pretty much just that and it gets worse on like my period you know but also i don't know if you guys noticed but i'm filming in a different location in my room ever since i moved i feel like i filmed in the same like two locations in my room I've never filmed at my desk before it's simply because i didn't have a chair when we moved i got rid of my chair because it didn't match my room aesthetic and so i literally got this chair out of the garage because i wanted to use my desk yesterday when i spent the whole day doing school so i grabbed this chair out of the garage and i claimed it as my desk chair now it's not very comfortable at least i can sit at my desk because before every day to get ready i would literally sit on the floor right here in front of my mirror and do my makeup it was fine i'm just low-key blind so i couldn't see what i was doing that well so thank goodness i can use my desk and see myself in this mirror now and a little while later the face is done like i said i like to take that time to myself so i just watch youtube videos on my phone color my face i actually tried this new liner pen from revlon they sent it to me yesterday i got it in pr it's their collab with megan the stallion craziest that they sent this to me but it's actually really good you guys know i'm like obsessed with liner so i just added a little tiny baby wing and i wanted to try this one that's what i used for that now i'm gonna eat something because i'm super hungry i wouldn't say i'm a huge breakfast person also nobody in my family knows how to cook including me so there's not a lot to do there alani knew sent me so much stuff i'm just gonna have one of the protein bars this is not sponsored i'm just obsessed i had this peanut butter one yesterday it was so good we also have munchies and cookies and cream which is my favorite so i think i'm gonna have one of these i know a lot of people ask for like the macros of these the macros of these protein bars are crazy you can see it right here 16 grams in this one for 180 calories with gluten free and pretty low sugar so that's really good for the taste and flavor you really can't beat it i'm obsessed I'm gonna eat one of these i also later before i go to the gym i want to try this new energy drink flavor this is like their halloween one it's called witch's brew and i haven't tried it yet we'll see that later this literally looks like a candy bar i'm gonna eat this protein bar and then get dressed charge my camera battery while i'm doing it because it's gonna die Here's the basic ugliness I came up with today. Underneath this zip up is a Lulu Align tank. This is in the color Ripened Raspberry. I'm just wearing this because I don't have to wear a bra with it. And today's back day at the gym, so I can wear this top and I don't have to change out of it. But because it's dress code, I'm just gonna put this zip up over top and it'll keep me warm, obviously, because it's a little chilly outside. This zip up is literally from Walmart. It's like $10 and I have so many of them and they're the best thing ever. Super like oversized and comfy. Then I'm just wearing my comfy Gymshark shorts. I get clown 
clowned on TikTok for like not knowing how to dress. And it's true, like I don't know how to dress. My style is just comfortable athleisure and I really don't care what it looks like as long as I'm comfortable and I can move around in it. And then on the bottom, high Nike socks and white vans. My white vans literally don't even look white. They're like off-white, but it's okay, it's fine. We're gonna put some deodorant and perfume on and brush my hair and then off to school. Please put deodorant on. If you don't wear deodorant in the morning, you stick and that's not good. Literally, I don't even know why I go to school for this period. It's my film class, guys. Like I literally go to school for my level four film class that I've been taking since freshman year because I already know how to do film. And it's so annoying that I even go. I already know what I'm doing and I have to like go to school. I think it's pointless. And my backpack. If you remember my first day of school video, I bought a folder and a notebook and I haven't used either of them yet, which I think is funny. The only thing I actually need is my laptop. Besides that, we're good to go. Let's go to school. Hashtag senior year. It's now 11 and I've arrived at school in my awful parking spot. How my school does it is a senior lot and a junior lot. In the senior lot, there's a top senior lot and a bottom senior lot, a top junior lot and a bottom junior lot. And I'm in top senior, which is awesome, but it's literally the worst top senior spot. I'm happy that I have top senior because that's awesome. It's okay though, like at least I have parking. Class starts in five minutes, so I'm gonna grab all my stuff, head on inside. Where's my mask? Look at this pretty mask Bella gave me. We always have to wear masks for like cheer and stuff and she gave me this really pretty disposable one that has like tie-dye on it. I want to wear it because I haven't, I haven't worn it. I feel like it kind of matches my shirt. I don't know why this makes me happy. Can you even see it? How cute! Literally I was driving with the windows down now my hair is a mess again so like I don't even see the point of brushing it in the morning you know? It's just ugly. <laughs> Keys, backpack, mask, phone. Let's do this thing. Oh I don't want to do this thing. <laughs> Too much editing? It's just that. We are in the morning show class. We just had our little lecture and now we get to split off and do whatever video that we're working on. I'm like helping with a diss track for like a local school that we always do. Well, that's what I was doing. We just watched a diss track that another school put out and it was so incredibly bad, but my boo was in it, so it's fine. <laughs> just kidding, I don't have a boo. Or it's gonna be so much better. Maybe I'll give you guys a sneak peek if I can show you. Here's the thing, any diss track that you put on against a school is not gonna be good because it's high schoolers and it's supposed to be cheesy and stupid. That's how they all are, but at least ours is like film good and the audio is good, so. And then Carson's gonna be like, what do you mean? Like, I just got a class pet. Like, what's going on? Let's get your business up. Must feel bad that you'll never be better than us. Must be so high in your wish. So they're still editing and they're gonna get rid of like the text right yeah, here. Yeah, they're gonna get rid of the text. They have to color correct. They have to like. Go ahead, Austin. Here, you tell them. <laughs> Vlog. Vlog at all. I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, we have to color correct, take away the, the text. Mm -hmm. They have to time some of the clips, like the, the ones of uh, Porter and mm -hmm. the chicken coffee. The taking costume. And then I think that's it. We made a Spotify canvas thing, like for Spotify, when it's like in the background. Really? Show me. Yeah. I made, I made this one. So they're getting rid of this text that says not today, and then under here is like me, Mac, Jamie, yeah. like all of us singing and stuff. I, mean, I don't know. This we is just the Spotify to canvas card that's gonna like be in the background. That's dope. That's so, so cool. So that's gonna be like in the background spot. I love that. It's actually coming together pretty good. Like, look at this timeline. If you know anything that's what about. I'm saying, like, if you see that timeline. If you know anything about editing, you know this timeline is crazy. Yo, it's gonna be insane. This is like a crazy timeline, and I'm so excited. <laughs> No, like literally, this is tonight. We're just, just like straight again. Look, it's Danny. <laughs> They got so many good shots. They the really office. did. I'm surprised. Okay, vlog. That was it. That was the morning show class. That's Austin, in case you didn't catch that. Yeah. <laughs> um, I just kind of didn't do much, but it's fine. We're going to go home, change, go to the gym, because that's my favorite part of the day. But yeah, the music video is coming pretty good. I think that's about it. Say bye, vlog. Bye. <laughs> I'm clearly home from school, and now I'm going to the gym. This is what I do every single day. Think of it as like my morning routine, because it's 1240 right now. I've only been awake for like almost three three hours, so it's still my morning. School and then gym is my everyday routine. The days that I don't have cheer practice, I have work, and the days that I don't have work, I have cheer practice. So that's how I kind of schedule my afternoon activities. For instance, I worked Monday and Tuesday, today's Wednesday, and I have cheer practice. That's what we're doing today. A lot of people are still asking me where I work. I do still work at the golf simulator place, which I know I've explained in the past. If you're confused, yes, I work a normal job as well as YouTube and social media. I just kind of schedule my week around what days I have cheer, and work. I always find time for the gym because that's my favorite part of the day. So I do it as soon as I get home from school around like lunchtime because it's the only time I have. I have cheer practice at 3.30 today and it's almost one so that'll give me a perfect amount of time 
at the gym. This is a Lululemon Align tank. And then I switched my shorts. They're still Gymshark, but these are like the athletic material, not like the comfy material. I don't like wearing like super like comfy loungy shorts at the gym because they feel weird to me. So I always wear like athletic ones if I'm not wearing like tight ones, you know? These are like my favorites. Then I put my Nike, <laughs> I put my Nike mid blazers on. Those are my gym shoes that I always wear. And I'm gonna grab my bag. Here's my gym bag. If you guys wanna see a what's in my gym bag, you let me know because there is so much stuff in here and I haven't been through it in a while. This is it. I put my hair up when I get there because I like have the windows down and let my hair flow. This is what we got for now and I'll see you guys when we get there. I'm gonna hopefully be able to record a little bit of my workout. Not the full thing, but I'll record some of it to show you guys. But yeah, let's go. Before I drive off, I am not a big like eater before I go to the gym. I don't like to eat something heavy, but I always have a Rice Krispie Treat. It's a good snack. The glucose gets into your body system super fast, gives you a good pump because it's just really simple carbs and simple carbs are good. They digest fast and that's what you want. I like always eat a Rice Krispie Treat on the way to the gym. I told you guys I wanted to try this Witch's Brew Alani New flavor. So we're gonna try it together. I honestly have no idea what this is gonna taste like. What even is Witch's Brew? I'm guessing like caramel apple because that's what it looks like on the outside. Yeah, I would definitely say that's like apple flavor. It's really good. I wouldn't taste as much caramel. It smells just like how it tastes. Yum. I never drink a full one of these. It is carbonated and carbonation makes me burp. I don't want to be burping at the gym. So I just take a few sips on the way to wash down my Rice Krispie Treat. Yeah, and then I eat when I come back. I just have like a schedule and I like sticking to it. Let me buckle and now we can go to the gym. Look at my handwriting. It's so good. Coach Leo at Tap Out Fitness. <laughs> Coach Quincy, we're gonna be doing some crazy workout today. So what do we have? We have okay. fish, but we're doing power and then cork. Yes, sir. She happens, right? Okay? Boom. Amazing. <laughs> I low key work here, but we keep it on the DL. I like help clean, write workouts. I help make workouts. I've taken training, teaching classes. I want to work here so bad. Like, officially, officially, they call me like the tap out intern because they want to hire me, but they have like certain things that they have to go through first because they just got new management and stuff. I literally love my gym. It feels like my home. Like I said, low key work here, but until I officially work here, I'm just going to say I do. But I love it here. Tap out is my happy place. I literally love everybody that works here. I'm ready for this work. Workout. Like I said, I'm gonna record a little bit of it. Not all that much because sometimes I get scared I don't know if I've told you guys this but I actually have really stopped taking pre-workout It became something that I was so dependent on if you have to take pre-workout to go to the gym You're not doing good things for your muscles. So I've been taking pre-workout a lot less I would say maybe once every two weeks. It really just depends. I've been doing it on no caffeine nothing I had a few sips of that a lot of drink no pre-workout and I've been loving it I took my rings off and I'm gonna put my airpods in and then we can go work out obvious that my camera died while I was at the gym but I got home and I changed I just put on a big t-shirt and some different shoes because now I have to go to cheer practice it's 328 and it starts in about like 10 minutes so I'm just gonna leave the house and go there hopefully my camera doesn't die again I charged the battery but I was only home for like 15 minutes because I didn't get home from the gym till 315 I had such a good workout I had a back and buys day and then I did an interval walk on the treadmill for 20 minutes and then interval sprints which literally killed me I was dripping in sweat I had some time to air out and now I'm just comfortably going to cheer practice now so Let's go. Hi, Katie's vlog. Come here, freshman. Freshman in the vlog. Freshman this, in the cut. This is my son. In a couple years, I'm gonna come back and have like two kids by the age of oh 17. Oh my god. Yeah. Okay, guys, we made it to the school and we're getting the speaker for cheer practice. I literally just spilt my Alani New all over the floor. Everywhere. That was not good. This is the first time in like two weeks I've put on actual clothes. <laughs> the last two weeks I have worn sweatpants and a sweatshirt. I went to the store and I got new sweatpants so that I wasn't wearing the same ones every day. Look, it's my little! Everybody say hi, Kira. I'm not that tall. Hey, Kira. 
<laughs> On the way to practice, we're probably gonna make some signs. No, nope. right? I don't think so. We're learning a dance. Why are we making signs? Oh, probably. I don't know. We don't I'm know upset. It. I don't know why we we're learning a dance when we have like four games yeah, left in the season. And we have so many dances. I just don't understand. It's not like we can even do it on the sideline anymore. Hi! You're making your recurrence back in the vlog. Oh, what? Hello. Hello, people. <laughs> this is not the indie show. Out of here! Get out of here! Katie, I, I'm Katie's favorite on the entire channel. Oh, who said that? Oh god, we're gonna get in trouble. You look so tan. <laughs> you guys wish. It's quick record. There you Hi, go. Vlog. Aww. Your camera's my so junior. nice. Hi, oh my, my junior. <gasps> I'm going to scare. Oh, I'm doing your filming. <laughs> Katie's corner cut. Cheer practice complete. We learned a new dance. I feel like we're basically just a dance team at this point, but I love it. Dancing's like so fun and we get to play good music and the band plays good music. It's now 5 p.m. and Bella and I are gonna go to Chronic Taco, which is my favorite place ever. They have the best Mexican food. It's like Chipotle, but better. Let's go get some Chronic Taco. It's like a bowl mm. and I get so much lettuce. Lettuce is my favorite food. But cheer practice was good. I like seeing all my friends. <laughs> So much lettuce and then rice, beans, chicken, cheese. We're at Chronic. I'm gonna get a, I'm gonna get a lid. Look how like, perfectly I ate this. Like it's like I devoured my burrito. It was delicious. <laughs> Time to go do homework for the rest of the night. So Bella's obsessed with me. <laughs> I'm just kidding. We're going to the mall because I really want these airy flared pants. They never have the size that I want or need and I've gone like three times, but we're gonna try again. I think I should just not let her get in the car. She's making me drive because she doesn't want to drive because she's obsessed with me. It's literally unlocked. Well, it didn't open. Clearly. Let's what go to the mall. It's Blurb. Blurb. I love Blurb. He's my stress toy when like people can't drive, when I can't drive. I'm just like, my brothers also like squish him and now he's a little broken. But isn't he so cute? Are you gonna hold him or I guess I'll hold him. Okay, let's go to the mall. Okay, friends. I did not vlog inside of Aerie and I just totally forgot to bring my camera into the mall. But I ended up getting something and the other day I went to Sephora. So I thought we'd just do a little mini haul of a few things I bought. I'm actually now on a budget and I'm budgeting my money because I feel like I spend a lot. But I also save a lot which you guys don't see but I want to save more because I have plans in the future that I need to be accountable for and save money for if I want to be successful and be able to live the life that I want to live then I want to have money to be able to do so and travel you know so I'm saving money now I decided I still went shopping a little bit after this I'm gonna save money okay <laughs> at Aerie I just got one thing I really wanted the flare Aerie cross pants because I have the cross leggings but I tried these on because they didn't have the cross ones the flare pants in store and these are just like these straight across flare pants so like they don't Cross. They're just straight right here yoga pants and then they have a bigger flare and they're on sale So they're the offline OG super flare and I got mine in a size medium I wear a size small and everything airy these they said they ran small so I got a medium That's what they look like. I was like why not get them but I'm not gonna spend money anymore Probably wear this to school Sephora. I just went and got one thing. I live really close to Sephora now I only really spend money on this high-end product This is the only eyebrow pencil that works for me because my hair is like naturally blonde So this is the Anastasia brow Wiz in the shade blonde. I've literally been using this since the seventh grade. I refuse to do my brows with anything else. It matches my hair perfectly. It's so expensive. This brow pencil is $25 and I could get like 10 eyebrow pencils from the drugstore from e.l.f. for that price. Now I'm sitting at my desk, which I'm so excited to have a chair for. This is so incredibly nice. I normally do my work at my bed, but it's nice to have like a work life balance so I can sit here, do homework, get ready and lay on my bed when I'm comfortable. I also get so many questions of people being like, Katie, you do so much in a day. How do you have time for homework? Yesterday was a day where all I did was do homework. It like got on my responsibilities done and when I had time I did all my homework I just budget my time to make sure that I have time to get all my classes done again school is something that's important to me so it's really just finding the balance between what's important to you like your own time I also I'll show you guys I keep as you can see right here I keep a list of all of my assignments you can see econ I'm working on this unit human anatomy I'm working on this unit and my college lit class my draft for my essays due soon and my math email and math test so I just keep a list of all the stuff that's due and that way I can check it whenever I need Need to. Lists are what works for me, so you just have to find what works for you. And I love having a to-do list because I get to cross stuff off. And when I cross stuff off, it's so much more easy for me to understand and see what's going on. I'm going to do some homework now. I don't think it's gonna be interesting for you guys to look at. I emailed my teacher and I'm really scared to see his response. Emailing your teacher is scary. We're gonna do some homework. <laughs> 
my gosh, I haven't left this chair since whenever I last vlogged. I don't remember what time it was. My Apple Watch literally changes the face of it all the time. And I set it to what I want the watch face to be. And it never stays. There we go. 9.34. I'm pretty sure I started this at like what? 7? 6? I, I don't know. I got done all the work that I need to get done tonight, which makes me really happy. I just need my teachers to grade some stuff. But besides that, I'm pretty good. I think all I'm going to do now is shower and go to bed. I've been trying to go to bed at a more reasonable time. I'm trying to prioritize myself. I feel like sleeping is good. First, what I'm going to do is end this video and then import the footage to my laptop. So there's a few clips that I want to go look at. <laughs> With that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this day in my life, what it looks like to be a senior in high school and be very busy. <laughs> if you did, please subscribe, give it a big thumbs up and follow all my socials. They're all just at Katie underscore McKenzie. If you want to see more daily vlogs like this, let me know what kind of content you want to see. I've been trying to be more active on my channel and I feel like I've successfully done it. Go check out my past few videos, thrifting vlog, outfits of the week, a lot of stuff like that. I'll see you guys in my next video and bye.